No one can match the might of Skeletor, not even that fool He-Man! <laughs>Howdy folks, my name is Richie, aka Botgotter, back with another Guild Wars 2 video. The Festival of the Four Winds patch has arrived, and with it is something interesting in the gem store. Well, they are advertising that there are new faces in the total makeover kits. I believe there are three new faces per gender per race. So that's a bunch of new faces options available to people who have the total makeover kit. So I thought I would preview them for you and give my first impressions of them, because I haven't seen these yet before. So we will... Take off my Nord's armor here. We'll head over to the heads. And, oh, uh, they already had exclusive faces there. I'm going to assume it's the three on the left-hand side here. Um, okay, yeah, that face doesn't look familiar to me. Obviously, I could take away the bearding. Let's take away the bearding so you can see it in all of its glory. All right, so he that looks like a pretty regular face. Maybe his eyes are a little bit more open than some of the the normal faces. Yeah, his eyes are a little bit wider. This one here. Yeah, he's more like, surprised. Hello. I'm wide awake. I just had coffee. All right, let's look at this guy. Okay, so it's wide awake guy with scars and a bigger nose. Is it a bigger nose? No, just a redder nose. Okay, and then finally down here. Oh, a little bit older. All right, so this guy is a man of advancing years. And he looks tired and not too happy, actually, overall. I'm not getting the warm fuzzy from him. All right, so those are the three male Norn. Let's check out the female versions here. All right, and here we go. First new one. Okay, lots of makeup, Norn. <laughs> She's, she, and she has very dark eyebrows, very dark uh, eyeliner on, and red lipstick. So that's that one. Okay, this one, much more natural. Pink lips, though. Again, with it, um, for some reason, it looks like the eyes are more open. Yeah, some of these are just squintier. And then this one, more wide. She's like more bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. And the third one, okay, that's pretty similar to this one. They're fairly similar. Just one has got more pronounced makeup. So, that's a lot of makeup, semi-makeup, and more natural. Those are the three female Norn looks. Okay, I'm here with my uh, char. Let's take a look at how the char faces look. We'll remove the armor. This is the female char we're doing first here. Put on the faces, and what do we got? That kind of... What's with the teeth? Oh, the teeth look the same. It's just the, the dark around there it makes them look buck teeth. I don't know. I like how they're kind of kind of going for like a little bit of a hyena look there, it looks like, with the coloration that they use, but... I don't know, it makes the teeth stand out a whole lot. It makes them look like, oh, uh, have, you, have you seen anybody that I'm looking for? Okay, I'm going to go over here now. I don't like it. <laughs> what about this guy? What is up with that? What is up with that char? That is just, maybe it just doesn't look good because I haven't like, I don't know. Do you have to like play around with these? Maybe, maybe with my presets on my character, it doesn't look great. I with... There's just something, there's something not right with this. <laughs> Different eye colors. There we go. Oh my gosh. You can make it look like Gollum. My precious! Oh, that doesn't, that's not doing it for me. I can't figure out that's, if I, if it's, maybe it's not the eyes, maybe it's something else that's, I don't know. He look, that makes him look freaky. That's a freaky little uh, female char right there. All right, let's go to the third one. Um, face. And what do we got here? Oh, now that one. That is wicked. As much as I didn't like the last one, I like this one a whole lot. Wow. That's pretty darn cool. She looks much more like sinister. Give it different color eyes. Yeah. Oh, I like that. Well done on that face. All right, let's check out the male. Uh, male char. There he is. Now, obviously, you can change the fur colors and all that kind of stuff to make it look different. All right, so here's our uh, char. Give a face here. And <laughs> Who's a happy lion? Who's a happy lion? I am. I'm a happy lion. <laughs> 
I love it. It makes it more docile, doesn't it? That's pretty funny. And now that guy is cool. He's cool as hell. I wonder, like, can we do, like, more of a, a mean type hairstyle to go with that? I'm trying to figure out, like, a good look like that. That looks pretty cool. Yeah, there we go. I like that face a whole lot. Very good on the char. You got some really interesting options with the char. And then this guy, huh? That's pretty interesting too. You, what are those? Does he have a gem encrusted face? That's interesting. I like the expression. He, he kind of looks. He look, kind of looks pretty vicious. But I could see like the gems and stuff being good for like char mesmers or uh, elementalists. You know, more of the magic using classes. I don't know, I think the char are going to be tough to beat. There's at least one face on each of the female and the male that I'm just totally in love with. I, I love how this whole thing looks there. Alright, let's check out the next race. Alright, taking a look at the human female here. Let's see what we got. Anything good? Okay, that's it's pretty similar to what I had before. Let's see, if I cancel... Let's just go back in there real quick, because was, that was a very subtle change to what I had. All right, so take a look at the the one the face that I have here and there we go. Kind of a little bit different. A little bit different makeup, a little bit of different expression, but mostly the same as what I had. Okay, that one has heavy makeup. Heavy 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 heavy. Okay, she is getting all dolled up for a night on the town and the last freckles. The freckles actually works pretty well with the hair color I've chosen here too. All right. It's pretty cool. Nothing I'm jumping up and down about, but got some more options. More options is always good. All right, let's check out. All right, first of all, I have to change his hair because I can't stand that hair. <laughs> let's do, do anything, anything but that. Anything but that. All right, where's my face? Faces. Here we go. What do we got? All right, we've got Mr. I got caught in the eye. I forgot to duck, and I'm not so happy about it. And Mr. Unibrow. Bushy unibrow guy. Hello. And it's the same. It's basically the same guy. Th this guy didn't shave, and he's angry. And this is he gets up in the morning after a good night's sleep, and he's looking all refreshed. That icy blue stare and the fiery red hair, and I don't know. Nothing more to say. All right, the humans are pretty. Eh. None of them really stand out to me, but they're humans. I'm a human myself. It's kind of boring. Okay, Silvari is up next. Let's see what we got here. We'll start with the female. Uh, I might change my skin color on this character just so you can see a little bit better. Let me do something like that. Okay, so faces. Here we go. Number one. Um, I like that actually. It's 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 nothing like that super stands out but i like the wide eyes but it's also kind of like a almost inhuman stare little cute face i like that one so that's kind of similar to the the other one except for it's got more of a i don't know more of angled features more almost more barky looking the eye shape is different it's got more of a smiley expression that's pretty cool and the third one okay yeah, more more uh, decorations on the face to make it look like freckles of sorts. I think um, all of those are pretty cool. Like the last batch we got, we got the, <laughs> we got this funky looking one. Um, but yeah, I, I I like the fact that you have so many more options now for the faces. I, I like all three of these. Those are pretty good. Let's see what they did on the the male side. Which we got? What do we got, Mr. Bondi? Faces. All right, there's something going on with this guy. What happened to you? Some like kid was like prying on his face while he was dreaming and like tore some of the bark off of one side. That's pr probably a pretty good option for people who want to be more like rugged looking. Interesting that they didn't do something equivalent on the female side, but this guy, this guy's all sorts of beat up. <laughs> he didn't, he didn't fall out of the ugly tree. He is the ugly tree. <laughs> Alright, so the next one. Oh, I like it. So it's the same kind of 
It's the same thing, pretty much. But I just like this expression and coloration better. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And then the third one. All right, so they use the same, like that that piece of bark that's stuck on the side of the his left side of his face over here. They they use that pattern for all three of these. They didn't have anything quite like that in the original faces. No. All right, so that's a new side bark thing, and uh, just the eyes and and different things are are different. I think this guy's pretty cool. Now, what happens if you change the eye color? Can you change the eye color is the question. How do you change the eye color? Facial detail. Right, let's try. Did I go to the right one? The guy in the bottom. All right, guy in the bottom. Into his eyes. There we go. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see the different eye colors with this one. Because his eyes are... He's more sunk in and, and dark. But those are pretty cool. All right, we got uh, just the Asura left. Let's go check it out. Okay, and last and quite possibly least, the Asura. <laughs> we get a lot of hate mail for that. All right, so let's find out what they've done with these little blighters. What do we got here? Faces. Oh, creepy alien. All right, wait. First of all... I have to take off my armor because it's going to impact the faces. There we go. So it's only creepy when you have the necromancer mask on, the devil mask thingy. Because it gets a whole lot cuter when you just do that. Hello, I've lost my puppy. Can you help me find my puppy? I hate you and will take out your soul. <coughs> Sorry. Okay, so <laughs> there's that. That is so kind of adorable and... A little bit freaky at the same time. I bet if I bet it'd be a little less freaky if can tone down the eye size. The ah, eh, oh, there we go. That's more normal. More normal. So you gotta have to factor in that some of the sliders can make a big difference here. Here, hello. Oh, I love you so much. I'll do anything for you. I'm suspicious. Okay, anyway, not enough of that face. I'll sit here all day making noises. All right, and the next one? Okay, that's a little more sinister just on its own. And then... Okay, that's pretty cool. They kind of look more babyish, a little baby face-ish. Coloration still there. All right, and the third one? What do we got? Ooh, freaky eyes. And let's take, put that on. So that just makes it all sorts of wrong. Yeah, th these uh, pretty cool faces there. They definitely have some different options for these guys. I, l I like that. They're kind of cute, but at the same time, they they've got that like doll-like quality that kind of makes them freaky. Like you you sit them in your you sit these Asura in your room, and during the day they're all fine, and then at night you just can't sleep because they're looking at me, Dad. They're looking at me. Does that happen to everybody else, or is that just me? It's probably just me. Let's try the female version, and what do we got? Female. Are we ready? And whoop bang Okay, pretty cool. I like the eyelashes. Like I lost my way. It's okay. Okay, and next one. So this is mimicking the male story here. So the the vertical uh, irises there are kind of make these guys a little scarier. Definitely. And what we got for the last one? Okay, so yeah, all three of these mimic the uh, look of the male. It's just, it's mainly, see, anything else changing? All right, this one's got, obviously got the face pattern. This one and this one, this is, has freckles. But mostly, it's just the eyes that change here. That's pretty cool. All right, so guys, what do you think about all of these options? Which are, which are your favorite? Are you going to consider actually changing the look of your character based on seeing those? Let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button, favorite the video, and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to be notified when future videos are released. Follow me on Twitter for gaming-related, um, you know, messages of 140 characters or less. That's Twitter at Richie Procopio. And I hope everybody has a fantastic day, and I'll see you next time. Take care.